Good day, everyone. So for today's lesson is all about finding the unknown in addition and subtraction. But before we're going to store, let's try to take a look at this video first. Cast, addition, and subtraction are related. Let's look at this equation. 7 plus 5 equals 12. The three numbers in this equation, 7, 5, and 12, are part of a fact family. We can create another addition sentence from these numbers, which is 5 plus 7 equals 12. We can also create two subtraction sentences, which are 12 minus 7 equals 5, and 12 minus 5 equals 7. By remembering how fact families work, we can find unknown numbers in an addition or subtraction equation. Let's practice with an addition equation first. We have here addition. We have 730,625 plus blank equals 946,728. So what are we going to do to find this missing number or this unknown number? So we're going to deduct 946,728 to 730,625. So let's try solving this problem. So 8 minus 5 is equal to 3. How about 2 minus 2? That is equal to 0. 7 minus 6 is 1. How about 6 minus 0? So it is 6. We can just bring down 6. 4 minus 3. So it is 1. Then 9 minus 7 is 2. So our missing number is 200. 16,103. We have here another example. So, 2,230,489 plus blank equals 4,997,899. So, what are we going to do? We need to minus these two numbers. So let's start. 9 minus 9 is equal to 0. 9 minus 8 is 1. 8 minus 4 is 4. Then 7 minus 0 is 7. How about 9 minus 3? It is 6. Next, 9 minus 2, it is 7. Then, 4 minus 2 is 2. So, what is our answer? Or what is the unknown number? It is 2,767,000. 410. So this is our last example. We have 505,328 plus blank equals 890,546. So what are we going to do? We need to deduct 890,546 to 505,328. So let's try solving this problem. Let's start. 6 minus 8 is equals? No, we cannot deduct this number since 
our upper number has a bigger value than our lower number. So what are we going to do? Use the borrowing technique. So we're going to borrow from our neighbor. So 4, we're going to cancel 4 and that makes us 3. Then we give it to 6. The 1, we give it to 6 which make it as 16. Now we can subtract these numbers. So 16 minus 8 is equals to 8. How about 3 minus 2? It is 1. 5 minus 3 is 2. Then 0 minus 5. So we cannot subtract these following numbers. So what are we going to do? Use the borrowing technique. So 9 will be cancelled. So that makes us 8. Then we give 1 to 0. So that makes us 10. Now we can subtract these numbers. So 10 minus 5 is equal to 5. How about 8 minus 0? So we're just going to bring down 8. Then 8 minus 5 is equal to 3. So what is the missing number? It is 385,218. So let's calculate subtraction. So we have here blank minus 1,462,952 is equal to 3,537,000. 435. So if in addition we need to subtract these following numbers, how about in subtraction? So what are we going to do? We need to add these two following numbers. So we're going to add 3,537,435. Four hundred thirty five to one million four hundred sixty two thousand nine hundred fifty two. So that we can get these unknown number. So are you ready? So we have here five plus two that is equal to seven. How about three plus five? So it is eight. 4 plus 9 is equal to 13. Since it is 13, we need to carry 1. So we have 7 plus 1, it is 8. Plus 2, that is 8 plus 2, that is equal to 10. Since we have 10, we put there 0 and carry our 1. So 3 plus 1, it is 4. Plus 6, it is 10. So we put 0 and have carry 1. So 5 plus 1, it is 6. Plus 4, that is equal to 10. So we put there again 0. Then we carry another 1. So 3 plus 1, that is 4. Then we add another 1, that is equivalent to 5. So the missing number is 5,387. How about this? We have blank minus 3,405,458 is equal to 2 million. 306,960. So what are we going to do? We need to add. So 8 plus 0 is 8. How about 5 plus 6? It is 11. So we need to carry 1. 
So 4 plus 1, it is 5. Plus 9, 14. So we put there 4 and carry 1. So 5 plus 1, it is 6. Plus 6, it is equal to 12. So carry another 1. So 0 plus 0, that is equivalent to 0. Plus 1, that is 1. So 4 plus 3, it is 7. Then 3 plus 2, it is 5. So what is our missing number? It is 5,712,418. So let's try these following problems. Are you ready? So can you solve this for me? We have 2,230,489 plus blank equals 4,997,899. So what is your answer? It is 2,760,000. Are you correct? Very good. How about number two? Blanc minus 3,405,458 is equal to 2,306,960. Can you solve it? So what is your answer? Kindly check it also if you are correct. So the answer is 5,712,418. So what are we going to do here so that we can get our answer? We need to add these two following numbers. How about the last one? We have 4,068,000. 726 minus blank is equal to 2,806,720. So what is your answer? Very good. So our answer is 6,875,446. So I hope you understand our lesson for today about finding the unknown numbers. So thank you and see you again in our next video.